It's not legal in much of the state and certainly not in Colorado Springs, but you may soon be able to walk around with a drink in your hand on the Riverwalk in Pueblo. KRDO News Channel 13's Sean Rice is live there with more on this new concept. Sean. Heather Mallory, the establishment of a liquor and entertainment district will have limits. It will only be for specific areas of downtown Pueblo and only be on certain occasions when partygoers can go from one bar to another with an alcoholic beverage in hand. Consuming alcohol outdoors may get easier in downtown Pueblo with the establishment of a liquor and entertainment district. 100 acres or less area in which you can have these smaller common consumption areas. And in those smaller common consumption areas, those small areas are actually the areas where you would have people walking around with their drinks, um, enjoying them from potentially several different liquor establishments. The map stretches from the top of Main Street to Abriendo Avenue and includes the Riverwalk and Union Avenue, popular drinking areas in the Steel City. The consumption areas may not be active year round or 24 seven, rather for specific events or nights of the year. Part of the um, application process would actually require that the promotional association submit the list of dates and times that they would like this to be active and it will have to be approved by the liquor board. The goal to help businesses in downtown Pueblo prosper and make money during usual slow times of the year. A lot of the downtown restaurants when I had a restaurant on the Riverwalk um, those events kind of got me through the entire month um, one or two days. I, I don't see any harm in it um, so I think that the, the misconception could be that it's, you know, open container for the entire map, but um, that's not what we're yeah. talking about. Creating a promotional association is not free. Each business that chooses to opt into the district will have to pay the liquor board a $500 fee at first. Reporting live in downtown Pueblo, Sean Rice, Cardio News Channel 13. Sean, thank you.